Well, hello, Virgos. That's Virgo singles. Welcome to Send the Moon Goddess channel. Now, when we do Virgos, when we do singles here, we take three love cards and their oracle cards, and then we clarify them with the tarot cards. All right, Spirit, this is for Virgo. Virgo, Virgo singles, please. Oh, Virgos, what's going on with you? No love in your life? <laughs> Ooh. Okay. They said that's what I get for being funny. All right. <laughs> Virgos, now before we go on, I need to ask you if you please can help us out. Um, we're trying to get to that 1,000 mark, and we're almost there. We just need your help. Hit that button over there to the right. Now, you want to do that because we are going to add things to send the Moon Goddess channel. We're going to have contests, drawings, monthly and sometimes weekly. So, um, you want to hit that button right over there to the right. So, you'll be in the know when we have these things. All right, Virgos. All right, at the bottom of the deck, religious factors. All right, now. Mm. Mm. All right, let's start off with this one. Children, your love life is being affected by children. Hard to hard conversation. Honestly discuss your feelings with each other. You need to flirt a little more. I don't know how a Virgo can flirt in more than we already do. And yes, Virgos, I am a Virgo. Yes. Good. Mm, all right. And um, past lifetime relationship. You may have known each other before. And now let's go. Let's get it. Let's start with these children. Spirit, I don't know. They might be affecting some people's love life. What's going on here? Okay. The divine is saying, don't worry. Uh, they are going to help guide you when it comes to this children. Okay? They just want you to have this heart to heart with this person that you might be in relationship with. Or this new person okay they seem to have strength to tell them exactly what you want to say okay but when it comes to the children the divine is going to help you and guide you so listen to your intuition now this new person is coming into your life. Is They're going to have communications that, with you. Because, see, they've been watching you on social media and stuff. So now they, they're ready to come forward to do a little flirting with you. So it's not you doing the flirting. It's them. Okay? So th this could be an air, a air sign, Libra, Gemini, or Aquarius, but a strong Libra. All right? So, yeah, it's going to be some flirting going on. Yeah. And when it comes to love, the Spirit wants you to have faith because your soulmate is coming with a lot of fire, a lot of passion, a free spirit person, someone who, who loves to communicate. So that's right up your alley, Virgo. So this also could be a fire sign. Okay, Aries, Sagittarius, a Leo. Strong Gemini in that air sign that I mentioned earlier. Okay, yes, that's a lot of love right there. So this could be the person from your past lifetime. Okay, you might have known the person before. That's what they saying. Yeah, yeah, it could be your ex. Yeah, 
but a change has come over you and you're going for this change because I'm, I'm seeing a lot of passion I'm seeing planning you're doing too <clears throat> you're doing a lot of planning Virgos yes and you're going for this love yep you're going forward with love some of you yeah Yes, yeah. spirit. Yeah. And a lot of you going what you're passionate about in your goals. A lot of you are. And you're going after them and you're going to achieve them. Okay? And some of you are going to, going to have choices when it comes to love. And could be someone a little bit younger than you. Okay? Again, that, there we go with that, that air. That Aries, Libra, Gemini, and Aquarius, and that fire, Aries, Sagittarius, and Leo. So some of you might have choices when it comes to love. And like I said, they're a little bit younger than you. And, and when it comes to love, you are going with the flow, Virgos. That's good. Sex has been good lately. That's what I'm hearing. All right, Virgos. <laughs> Going with the flow. I love it. Yes. Just keep your eyes on the prize. That's what they're saying. They want you to keep your eyes on the prize. Yeah. Because see, it's going to be a new beginning coming. Some of you doing spiritual work. So you're... You, you, that's coming. Some of you are going to learn your soul purpose. Some of you, is this a new beginning in love? That's why they keep telling you to keep your eyes on the prize. It is something coming towards you, though, that you don't see coming, Virgos. You don't see coming. Yeah. Wow. I saw that card back there. <laughs> yeah. Now, once once you let go of, of things that don't serve you, uh, I'm hearing family burdens, Virgos. Um, you know, sometimes you, you can't help everyone. So some things you're going to have to let go of. And, and I'm hearing his family burdens, you know, it said children. So it could be, it could be that. You, once you let that go, and then love will come. Love and opportunities. See, I, I see opportunities coming your way. I see opportunities coming your way. Okay? You're accomplishing some of your goals. Abundance of them. Okay? And I also see in love coming your way. And a commitment. A commitment. Okay, that could be that could be a Taurus. It also could be a Scorpio. Okay, or um, another Virgo or Capricorn. Strong Taurus and strong Scorpio. Okay, but here comes that fire. Yeah, it could be someone that's older than you, Virgo. So they, that's very stern and kind of stuck in their ways. But you are so carefree, you're going you're gonna to change them a little bit. Okay? All right. Go for it, Virgos. You got all that fire. I'm here. A lot of passion going on right now. Yeah. But what you don't see coming is love. Love is coming your way. A commitment is coming your way. Some of you might not even see it coming. Somebody who wants to come towards you to make a commitment. They keep saying you don't see it coming towards you. Okay? So they want you to pray and meditate. Because this person that's coming towards you wants a commitment from you. They want a commitment from you. Okay? The prince of this. Yeah, it's a new person. And some of you, it's going to be money. Some of you, it's going to be money and opportunities. But most of you, it's going to be someone new. It could be someone a little bit younger. 
a little bit different than you. So it could be younger, but just different. But it's going to be a lot of passion, a lot of love, and a lot of nurturing. And commitment. Okay? Yeah, Virgos. Yeah, <clears throat> when it comes to those opportunities, as I was saying, you are going to have to work hard to, to achieve what you want to achieve. But you already knew that. And it's okay with you. So just keep trusting your intuition. Keep going forward. Because those opportunities that you, you've been working hard for are on their way. But you have to trust your intuition. I just told Taurus the same thing. To trust the, their intuition. Yeah, see, when it comes to work, trust your intuition and have faith in yourself. Okay? And some of you, if you, if you, if you are in a relationship with another Virgo, they saying it's going to work out. Okay? But you need, when it comes to your job, your, your businesses, you, you need to trust your intuition that it, that it, that is going to work out. You got double sevens. And so the spirit is really trying to tell you, okay, not only um, things are going to work out in your money wise and, and you going for what you're passionate about, but also um, the spirit is with you. And some of you are having a spiritual awakening and, and, and you are do, you're on the right path. You're on the right path. Just keep trusting your intuition. Wow, that was double sevens. Strong intuition, Virgos, right now. Use it. Yes. And when it comes to your health, take care of yourself. Take care of yourself, Virgos. Okay, drink the water, eat the food. I know I don't have to tell you that, but they saying that you need to, t you need to take care of yourself. Self-care is, is in order here. And, 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 and things you don't want to do, I shouldn't have to say this to you Virgos, don't do it. Because you're not trusting your, your intuition. Yep. Yeah, some of you guys are going to have, when it comes to opportunities, you're going to have choices. And they coming in by communication through someone else. Okay? But they're going to be great opportunities for you. Where it goes. They're going to make you happy. But let me hear, not, in, not only if you're single, you're going to be very, very happy in these opportunities that's coming in because you, you're focusing on your careers and on your businesses. But they also telling you love is coming in too. So look out. Yeah. All right. See? <laughs> Can't make this shit up if I try, Virgo. I'm hearing your twin flame is coming. If you have not met them already. What did spirit give us at first? Flirts. Hard, hard conversations. All right past life relationship it may be a twin flame it could be a soulmate but i'm seeing twin flame it could be a leo another virgo or a scorpio but there is love in the air for you virgos you're not trusting it you're not trusting it 
Not one bit. But you are told to <laughs> trust that this is going to be a healing and a nurturing and full of love relationship. Oh, they said I forgot about the passion and adventure. <laughs> Start your planning, Virgos, because you are going to go on a trip. Just remember, everything is going to be okay. See, everything is fine. That new beginning in love. That's what's happening here. It's going to be a new beginning in love. Anything else for Virgos? Yeah, Virgos. You're going to get what you put out. Now, in your past relationship, you always the giver, the giver, the giver. But in this new relationship, you're going to be giving too. But remember to set your boundaries first, Virgos. That way you can get what you deserve. Listen to your intuition. Because the divine wants to guide you. Okay. Now this can be another Virgo or air sign. Libra, Gemini, or Aquarius. But both of you guys kind of think alike. Okay. That's one wh reason why it's going to work. Mm. Could be a earth sign, Virgo, Taurus, or Capricorn. But you got to go with the flow. You, you've been doing it, though. They're also saying it could be marriage in this situation. Okay? Good communication. Again, it could be a strong Taurus, a strong Scorpio, or a Virgo or Capricorn Virgo. Okay? I, I mean, I'm, I'm, okay, I'm going to stop because this is just... This is it right here. This is a lot of love right here. Okay? Commitment, communication, soulmate, family love. Can't ask for no more. All right, Virgos. That's what I have for you. But you know I can't let you go without asking you to like and share this video. And if you haven't already, Virgos, what are you waiting for? Hit that button over there to the right. All right, Virgos, I am Sin, the Moon Goddess. And I'm out.